Assalamu alaikum everyone, peace be with you guys. Welcome back to the Ummah channel. I have some very exciting news, inshallah, we are working on a mini documentary about the growing Muslim population in Puerto Rico. And with your support, inshallah, Rabbi Alameen, we're gonna make it happen. Now, we have realized throughout the two years Ummah Nation has been here, um, Muslims have been gaining exposure through media, and a lot of it is good. You know, we're seeing Muslims in commercials and film and documentaries. I mean, it's, it's very beautiful. It's a lot different than it was 10 years ago. However, some of that exposure is bad, and if I could sum it up in one sentence, it would be that um, Muslim stories are being told through media without our perspective. And I don't know how you can do that. How do you tell the Muslim story without the Muslim morals and values, without the Islamic faith? And a lot of authenticity gets lost in these stories because of that. Ummah Nation wants to come in and provide the solution. Ummah Nation wants to tell the Muslim story. Ummah Nation started off just with videos talking about solutions to common Muslim community issues. I just grabbed my phone and started recording and started talking. Eventually those videos became into interviews that we're having with Muslims who actually provide solutions to the community like Linda Sarsour when it comes to politics, uh, the celebrity of Tahaj Muhammad when it comes to Muslim businesses and being a celebrity, and Sheikh Isa Parada when it comes to the Latino community. Inshallah I mean, we have another big interview coming up with Steven Jackson, the NBA champion who recently accepted Islam. These videos influence us at Oman Nation to not just talk about solutions, but be a part of solutions. For example, we create, you know, marketing videos for Muslim businesses in order to help them grow. We've done unboxing videos so that you can see Muslim products. We even did vlogging videos and one of those videos was in Hayes, Kansas in the middle of America. There is a Muslim community and we talked about how small Muslim communities grow and function with such little resources. We did a vlogging video at Islam in Spanish and we talked about how they're building their message to such a functional message in order to help other masajid to think, you know, in a more functional perspective when it comes to building our mosques. One of our most fun projects is um, we created a short film about celebrating Eid during COVID. This was a very beautiful short film and we had a lot of great responses. A lot of people told us that the video brought them to tears and we were so blessed to be able to catch Muslim emotions through our short film. We even did a cooking video about how to make a date smoothie uh, for Sahur. Uh, by the way, it's super delicious, y'all should check it out. But that was also another you know, fun video that we created just for the community. Our most impactful video was a survey where we asked 100 plus Muslims how much they thought a sheikh's salary should be and compared it to how much sheikh's salaries actually are. This video had such an impact that we had many Muslim community members and board members contact us to discuss a solution for this issue. This video was viewed over 75,000 times throughout many platforms and we were so amazed to see that, you know, our videos aren't just videos uh, that's sitting on social media. They're actually playing a role within the community. And we are ready to take it to the next level. We want to create short films and documentaries so professional to the point that Netflix and Hulu and other streaming apps are interested in showcasing our documentaries. In order for that to happen, we need y'all's help to sponsor us so that we can afford the equipment to take Muslim media to the next level. Your sponsorship isn't just going to the Puerto Rican documentary. We're gonna use your sponsorship for just equipment, not for traveling, not for gas, not for food, so that you may get the reward from multiple projects because we're gonna be using this equipment for all other projects within Umma Nation so that we can continue to create free content for the community. There is no doubt that media plays a huge role and is extremely important in today's world. And us Muslims need to step up and be a player when it comes to the media. So I don't want us to just sit there and wait for other media organizations to tell our stories and don't even include our perspectives. I want to get up there and provide a space for us Muslims in media. So inshallah Rabbil Alameen, Please help sponsor Oma Nation so that we can tell your story.